Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to share with you my favorite kitchen tools. Some of them I have and some of them I have gifted and it make the process of cooking easier or if you're trying to eat more healthier, it's just convenient to have them in your home. It doesn't mean that you need to have these exact same ones, but maybe you have similar ones and they're perfect for yourself or for a gift or for that new couple that just moved to a new place, whatever the reason might be. I'm going to talk about why I like each one. So I'm going to link everything that I share in this video in the description box so that you are also able to get it. And without talking anymore, let's begin. So the first one that I want to share about is this juicer by Breville. And I just love making natural juices from home. The reason why I like this model is because this is the compact model. So it doesn't take a lot of space. Um, as you can see, this is the main body. And then it also brings this cup here. This is where it will collect the juice. So I just like knowing what I'm going to be drinking. So here you can put, for example, carrots, cucumber, oranges, whatever, you, whatever juice you want to make. You put it here. So I really like it for the size. The downside for me is when it comes to cleaning. Um, to me, I feel like it has a lot of pieces, but any juicer, you will have to clean either way. So you pull it from here. It has all these pieces. And this basically has all the sharp, tiny blades. So I love it. To me, it's worth it knowing that I'm going to be drinking a natural juice that's going to be good for your skin, good for your body. It's going to hydrate you. To me, it's just worth everything. So the next one that I want to share about is this food processor. This is by Cuisinart. And by the way, all these tools, all these kitchen devices that I have, I've had for many years. So that's why I like them and I recommend them. And not only that, I also like when they are small, when they don't take up a lot of space in the kitchen. Um, this one, it is a little heavy. But um, what you can do in here is like salsa, like natural salsa for your chips, for tacos. Um, what I've made here are raw desserts with like nuts and natural oils like coconut oil. And it's so delicious. You don't have to cook it. It's raw and it's healthy. You can even make like your own peanut butter. Like there are so many things you can do with it. Um, again, the only downside for me is the cleaning part because you have to take apart a lot of pieces, but it's so worth it knowing that you are making your own food from home and it's healthy. So to me, it's worth it. And by the way, this one has two buttons. You can leave it on or you can manually pulse it depending on the food that you're going to be making. So the next one I don't have physically with me. It's something that I gave to my mom a few years ago and basically it's a tofu press. Uh, for those of you who don't know, tofu is soy based and tofu doesn't have any flavor. So the way you make it delicious is how you cook it, what flavors you add, like what spices. And the right way to cook it is when you extract all the liquid so it's kind of like water so this presser what you do you put the tofu in the middle and you press it and that will extract all the liquid out so you're getting the tofu ready to cook so it can better absorb all the spices that you add so it's something so small but it's so useful when it comes to cooking tofu the next kitchen tool that i want to share about is this rice cooker I like this one specifically for two reasons. One, because of the size, and two, because it's small to you. So as I'm making my rice, I can also cook my veggies. A lot of the rice cookers that I've seen that are smaller, you can only cook rice, but with this one, you can create a whole meal all at once. And so basically, the way I cook my rice, I rinse the rice with water until I see that the water comes out clear. Then I put the rice with water, oil, so that the rice doesn't stick together. I add garlic powder, onion powder, um, pink salt, Himalayan salt, and then I let it sit there. And on top, I'll add my veggies. Then you just put this so with the heat from the vapor from the rice, the 
vegetables will start cooking and it takes about half an hour so that's what I love about it because you're creating a full meal and sometimes I will even add lentils to the rice so that I also have protein in the meal so I love it and this is a big one so you if you're into meal prep you can plan ahead the meal that you will eat for the week I've done that in the past so that's why I like the size because it's so convenient for that or if you're going to be cooking for your family that's why I love this one specifically okay so the next one is a citrus juicer and this one you can make juice from oranges from limes lemons from grapefruit so depending on what you have you can do a mixture and that way you are drinking natural pure juice from home and so what my mom likes to do she will buy a lot of limes and then she will extract the juice so she can fill up bottles that way we don't have to be cutting and squeezing limes each time we will have the bottle ready and we'll pour that over the food so it's so convenient this is a small kitchen tool and it's like the perfect gift okay the next one is this veggie sterilizer with this you can make noodles from zucchini instead of eating pasta um, you can make kind of the same dish but with vegetables and the way it works you pull this piece out you place the zucchini here you will roll this and from this side you will start getting all the noodles from zucchini so let me show you a picture of mine and this is something that you can cut tomato you can add onion you can add a dressing and it's so good it's so delicious and so healthy for you and you can see it's a little stained but I do use it so I like it and I recommend it too so as I mentioned to you guys my favorite one for last and this is my Vitamix blender I've had it for many years almost 10 years there's a new model but basically it has the same buttons the same functions and depending on what I'm going to be making if I'm going to be making like an everyday smoothie like one portion for that I'll use my magic bullet but if I'm going to be making like smoothies for different people then I'll use this one just because it is bigger or if I'll be making a soup or a dessert so it depends like the quantity then I'll use this one and the reason why I like it is because of the quality it is yes a little bit more on the expensive side but it's so worth it um, basically here you can see the on and off button this one you control how fast you want it to go it has numbers and this one is top speed this one will leave your food items really smooth creamy everything really well blended like I said it's really good quality I love it and I've had it for so long and I still use it if I were to get it again I think I would get it in white just because I my kitchen is white and I like white but nonetheless it does the work and I love it I recommend it so there you go guys these are some of my favorite kitchen tools that I really like that I recommend I have been using them for years you can use similar products but if you're interested in this specific ones I'm going to link it in the description box they are available on amazon.com and if you are interested I can share more about what I have in my kitchen or let me know what other type of videos you would like to see or just simply say a hi or hello in the comments section as always you can follow me on all social media accounts with the same name Lynn Sire if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one kisses bye